Hi everyone. Um, I've just started writing a song, and I was had a spontaneous idea to share it with you in a Facebook Live. Um, I hope I can tell this without crying. Uh, <laughs> I woke up uh, today, and it was one of those rare mornings where I could lay in my bed and muse a little before I got up. Um, that's that doesn't happen to me. Uh, a lot because I have kids and I work night shifts sometimes. Um, anyway, uh, sometimes when I had planned um, no songwriting, why should I? My debut EP is uh, recorded and it's coming up in April, so there's no need for writing songs right now. But I had this idea that was bubbling inside for a long time without me realize realizing it was there. Um, and this morning. I mused and I rushed to the desk in my pajamas and started writing some things um, and crying. <laughs> now, me getting emotional with writing a song, I always see it as a good thing. It's, it's just a sign that it is real and it touches me, so uh, I'm not concerned about that. Um, anyway, blah blah blah. Uh, I realize that I'm standing here learning how to allow myself to shine. Um, it has been a little bit of a struggle to know that I'm worth it doing what I love, uh, which is writing songs and uh, inspiring others to do the same. Um, now, um, my mother went through stuff in her life and without knowing, she cleared the way for me to do what I do now. And just like her mom did. My grandma, she uh, grew up during the Second World War in a part of the Netherlands where the culture is to uh, shut up and do as you are told. Um, who are you to take any stage for yourself? Modesty was the greatest good. Uh, again, her mom must have been growing up in the First World War they all fought their own wars, literally and figuratively, so that I, um, so my, my greatest concern is um, what shoes to buy, you know, and that is, that feels very like a special thing to me. Now, um, so the, the first verse, this is really before I start writing the actual song, um, the first uh, verse, is going to be about my grandmother, uh, my grandmother's grandmother holding her child in a shelter during, in a shelter during the fir first world, world war, um, and that child becomes the mother of my grandmother. Um, then the story goes on about my grandmother getting married and uh, have children because she had no choice. She told us a few times, uh, since we have a choice, we shouldn't have children. Um, she raised my mom during the time that women got the first rights and freedom of choice. Uh, as a young adult, my mom had uh, f feminist ideas, uh, but she grew up in this culture too, like um, of the culture of not talking, uh, not 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 taking the stage um, for your own individual freedom. So it was still there. Um, I'm a mom of two beautiful daughters. Um, thank heaven their greatest concern is not if, but what we're going to eat tonight. Um, now the course of the song has to be about allowing myself to shine because they opened doors for me uh, to do what I do and it was would be such a waste if I don't um, do it. Now I have the choice and I have the desire um, and I pass it on uh, to my children too. And the last part of the song might be about uh, me struggling with 
things in our time, like the economic situation, uh, economic system, I mean, and then um, technology coming up while we're not educated for it, stuff like that, etc. Et um, and uh, that opens new doors for my daughters and where they will have a benefit from in their lives. And I warn you, I start writing songs always with the same enthusiasm, but half of them do not reach the point of finished and satisfied about it. Um, if so, this idea will go back bubbling inside somewhere and, um, and develop and come out in a totally different song someday. So I'm never concerned about that. Um, sorry for my English, it's not perfect, I'm working on it. It was very exciting for me to do this first English speaking Facebook Live. I do many Facebook Lives, but most in Dutch or uh, not speaking at all um, because of hearing uh, music. Um, anyway, I'm going to get on with this song and uh, thanks for watching. Bye.